Hey guys, it's Megan. It's Dylan. Uh, so we are back with kind of an exciting thing. Um, so we got the Share the Seed Pack. And the seed pack that is, um, it's a seed swap that is going around with um, some of the YouTube homesteaders. Uh, and there's a long list of people that it has come from. It has been, it started um, by Sandy at Suburban Homestead. Um, and like, I mean, it's been all, all over Ohio, Montana, Arkansas, Missouri, Indiana. Well, now it's in Indiana, but New York, like all sorts of places. Um, and so we were really excited. Scotty from Broke Urban Homestead, he uh, tagged us in this. And so I will leave his little video, um, in the description and then also in the little I card. Um, but I never thought of, I didn't think about it when I said, yeah, I will love to participate in the seed swap. Um, there's peanut seeds in here <laughs> and I've shared several times on our channel that I have a really bad food allergy to peanuts and I was like, oh no. And so this lovely handsome man right here is going to uh, be digging in here and uh, going through some of the seeds and we're just kind of kind of share with you guys some of the things that are in here uh, because in Scotty's video, it's a lot. Uh, we just cracked it open. Oops, sorry, so we just cracked, cracked it open. So there's a little envelope or a little folder there that shows everything and where it came from, but then we moved that bag. So, so those seeds came from Scotty. If we've got some instructions, but then there's several little packages here full of seeds. So it's like every gardener's dream. So I'm just gonna let Dylan kind of open it up and uh, see what goodies we got. And I will sit over here and drool. <laughs> so yeah, as she's done most of the talking, I would like to talk. I am actually <laughs> really excited about this. I was really uh, interested when my wife told me about this little operation going on about seeds. I'm like, don't you have enough seeds? You need more? Like, okay. Well, <laughs> But maybe we'll find some really cool stuff in here. So we'll uh, look at some seeds. Yeah. So I will say that I know that Scotty uh, put lots of different basil seeds in here. And I can already see them in this envelope over here. Um, because he, that was what he kind of decided was going to be his thing this year. Was to um, be like a basil farmer. And so he has all sorts of different basil seeds. Oh my gosh, Dylan, there's so many. Oh my goodness. Uh, just in like one Ziploc bag, you're like, <gasps> all the seeds. Sorry, you can see there's Mexican sunflowers. You're just going to be real slow at this, aren't you? <laughs> well, I'm just going to dive in. I don't know. I want to dive in, but I don't know where there might be peanut seeds. Mm. So there, there's sunflowers. Sunflower. I can't even say it. Tayo sunflower. So there's just sunflowers. This is from. Just, just keep, so it's just kind somewhere. of. Yeah. That said, along the river. So there's forage. Just dump it out. Cream of Saskatchewan watermelon. That's interesting. I'm hoping there's just nothing. Forget me not. So and there's dahlia seeds, there's purple cone flowers, there's zinnias, Johnny Jump Ups. I grew those for the first time in this year. They're really pretty. So these are pretty much all seeds or flower seeds. A lot, cool, a, lot a lot of new things. What is that one? Space Master Cucumbers. Space that Master from Space Master Cucumbers. Uh, but Lima, Lima beans. I'm trying not to touch everything, but I that too. <laughs> Oh, that's a pretty tomato. That is. That's really cool. What is this tomato? So this is a Baker Creek big red tomato. Look at the stripes on that one. Isn't it pretty? Then we got some squash seeds. We got uh, South True Seed. This is, oh, lettuce. I said it's lettuce. Lettuce. We got winter squash. That'd be cool to plant. In I've never seen the seed company. So True Seed. I like that name. That's cool. Be a seed company I'll have to look into. Always op open pollinated, untreated, and GMO free seed. True, So true seed. 
and neat. They have really cute little packaging. You got some Southern Charm watermelon. Watermelon. Everybody's a sucker for watermelon. Yeah. It's a big brown bag here. This is from Little Creek little Homestead. Little Creek Homestead. I just think Dana. So Dana. many <laughs> seeds. So there's okra seeds. A lot of their seeds are from Burpee. Yeah, marigolds. Marigolds. Cantaloupe. All of me some cantaloupe. Beets. Beets. Beets are good. I love beets. More okra. Easy there, radishes. Fair. You're going so slow. <laughs> well, I want people to get the full effect here. I mean, we need to know what's going on. Nostradamus. I can't even say these words. Nasturtiums. Nasturtiums. <laughs> Love nasturtiums. Um, if you've not planted nasturtiums, there's a variegated variety and they're really, really pretty. Uh, but they're edible. So I think the leaves are kind of spicy, but you can eat the flower, you can eat the leaves, um, and you can like add them to your salads and make it pretty and taste really good. But I have to say so far, I'm really, really impressed with all these seeds. It's like an early Christmas present with seeds. So this is Royal Amethyst Acres. That is an awesome name. Yeah. Got a little card in here. Yeah, it's just their contact information. That is neat. I like that. Yeah, so go check out Royal Amethyst Acres. Golden Bantam Sweet Corn. That Ooh. is neat. That's a I like her envelope. Really, really cool bag. Love I love like the that. envelope on that. That's it's awesome. Dark Star, Star zucchini. zucchini. Cherry Radishes. Ooh. Hale's Best 45 Watermelon. I think it's 45. Uh huh. You got some kohlrabi. What's kohlrabi? I'm not sure. I'll have to look it up. Anybody Italian grown? flat leaf parsley. parsley. That's really cool. I love the handwriting too. She's like gone calligraphy. I love. I absolutely love the packaging. It is very beautiful. Isn't that very pretty? Beautiful. And then she's like hand stitched oh, it. Man. Like all the love and care for seeds. Now this has to be my favorite so far. This is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I love Look that. Look at stitching. the packaging on this one. That is really cool. So pretty. So this is some golden bantam sweet corn. Isn't that pretty? That's so cool. But I think this really shows how much some people really love their seeds. Yeah. The love and care that gets put into things like this. Here, this card is in there. No! Oh, you can guess that would be he found peppers. No? Do really, Did I not find do peppers? Do you really have to like spoil everything? Like, Sorry. Like, it was my moment to shine in glory and then it's just like... <laughs> well, here's your moment to shine. You can rattle off what peppers are in this bag. Oh, we got mini bell peppers. Oh, I'm just in my pepper gosh. city. Jalapeno peppers. Sign mm -hmm. me up. I love peppers. Got, got some, some cauliflower. cauliflower. Oh, wow. Beets. Mammoth red mango. I just like got to show you. So this is a Baker Creek. Look at that beet she's holding. That is massive. That is huge. Eggplant. Tomato. So I'm just going to hold this up. So yeah, Mimsy. This that I was like, oh, that's from Anna. So Mimsy uh, is Mimsy's garden. Her name is Anna. She has a YouTube channel as well. I will uh, drop it down below. So this is a... Yamayo, yum. Yeah. Sorry, you'd say it, but it's a cream melon. I'll have to maybe check out some of those seeds. You got a purple hull pea. Those are cool looking. Triple O crop tomato. That's oh cool. yeah, Jess likes these. So Jess over at Roots and Refuge, that would be probably that triple crop tomato that she grows monsters Mammoth from. Mammoth red rock cabbage. That is very interesting. We should try to plant that. Oh, I don't like cabbage. Do you like cabbage? I would eat it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't grow it because I know homestead I wouldn't Homestead tomato, brandy wine. I like the tomato. homestead tomatoes. So as he's moving on to um, the next thing, I'm just going to kind of go over some of these channels that um, <clears throat> have participated in this. And you guys can go check them out. I'll try and leave them all linked down in the description below. But as, but as I had said, uh, it had started from Sandy over at the Suburban Homestead. Um, and she's in Wyoming. And then it got sent to Marie. Oh no. 
in uh, Salon Girl Gardens. And she's from Texas. What now? No, y'all sent him Carolina Reaper seeds. <laughs> oh, no. Papa Pepper, where are you no. at? I'm going to come see you. No. Because we need best friends. No. Oh, man. I figured I was hoping when I was opening this box I would find these. But some Carolina Reapers. And guess what's going to be in our garden next year? Some Reapers. We'll have to have some caution tape around it. Uh, it's how I'll continue with this list. But um, some seeds. we've joked about ordering some of those suckers like or like that seeds. hot spicy candy and like making a video. And I participate as well um, and see how we do in eating one of those suckers. Uh, if that's something that you would want to see, drop a comment down below. And it might be something that we do. Uh, we've oh, joked about God. it. I'm so excited. I'm going to make a video. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it tomorrow. I'm going to plant my first Carolina Reaper in our house and I'm going to grow it this winter. No, 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 no. So after it went to Salon Girl, it went to Diana from Move North Homestead. And then she sent it to Anna over at Menzies Garden. And uh, then it went to Kevin at Papa Pepper. And then it went to Vicki and Sammy at Little Creek Homestead. And then it went to Jen, Brian, Luke, Kelsey, Levi, Logan, and Chloe at the Davis Family Farm. And then it went to Dee and Jess from Naturally and C. Uh, it went to Jessica at J Love Adventures. Mandy over at Royal Amethyst Acres. And then it's gone to Along the River Homestead, uh, who is Chrissy. And then it got sent to Scotty uh, over at uh, Broker Bridge Farmer. So real quick, I just want to mention this next bag I'm open is from Davis, Davis Family, Family Farm. Farm. Jim, thank you. <laughs> yeah, so he's pulled out that Papa Pepper seed. Make That's a really pretty, pretty tomato. That is really, really cool. What is this tomato? Red, burgundy, onion. That's interesting. Milkweed butterfly. Copia? Cool. Copia, copia, copia tomato. It's really pretty. Got some basil, corn tree gold, let's get to it. Oh wow. Oh, that's a lot. Oh my goodness. <gasps> yes. No. Jimmy and Nard Nardello peppers. Those are sweet pepper, they're not spicy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I steal it. It's pepper. It's mine. Lofa sponge. It's a loofa gourd. Lofa sponges. That's what's hanging on oh. the trellis right now. Oh. I need really? to cut those down. Yeah. Scarlet runner beans. These suckers Those are, are huge. big beans. Those are huge beans. Like, here's my thumb. They're big old beans. After spreading all the seeds out all over the floor um, and figuring out what we wanted to take, I wanted to share with you guys what we are taking and then also what we are going to be sending. Uh, so Dylan picked out several different pepper varieties. Uh, he picked out Italian long red bell peppers from Suburban Homestead. Um, he picked out some Serrano pepper, whoops, dropped it, Serrano peppers from Papa Peppers, uh, and then he took, uh, some Carolina Reapers, um, and then I went through, and instead of just taking the whole seed packet, um, I'd save seeds for others that, that might want them. Um, so I took some Morning Glories from Royal Amethyst Acres and Mimsy's Garden, um, some Golden Bantam Sweet Corn from Royal Amethyst Acres. Uh, Dylan also wanted some yellow pep pencil hot peppers from Papa Pepper. Um, took some cream of Saskatchewan melons from Along the River Homestead. Uh, some Space Master cucumbers. That was from Naturally NC. And then um, I took a couple seeds out of the seed pack from uh, the triple L crop that I had talked about last night. And these were from Mimsy. Um, and then I took some seeds from Scotty. Um, they are blue spice basil. So those are some of the seeds that we took. Um, and then for some seeds that we are giving, um, I've got some sweet small red bell pepper. These are really, really good. If you follow us on Instagram, um, you'd see me make the giant, we actually have a video too, of homemade pizza. And I like to chop this up and put it on like my side of the pizza. 
um, some hill country red okra. I have a lot of seeds for those because um, we grew them and they it just did really well. Some scarlet carrots. These are from In My Gardener. Um, I just have some lettuce. Uh, this is a variety pack of sunflowers that we had got from a wedding <clears throat> and I ended up, I took like three of these, uh, because she had so many of them left over, uh, cause we had been in the wedding. And so just a variety of sunflowers and I planted several different, like, you know, you can tell the seeds are different, uh, different ones. And that's kind of what is in the garden. Um, some sweet William flowers, some purple cone flowers. Uh, so these are rattlesnake beans, which uh, we grew this year uh, from Two Family Homestead Senna's seeds. So they're seeds from our seeds. And then some green beans uh, that we have grown as well. So I've got all of those. Gonna pop them in the bag and uh, run over to the post office today and get this box mailed out. So exciting. Excited to see what Joyce and Jean pick from uh, this box as it heads their way. But we will uh, say <gasps> what mini. It's a bell pepper. Oh yeah. Sorry, <laughs> but as I was saying, we will say a good night to you guys and continue to uh, dig around in this box. Uh, so be sure to go down in the description and check out all of these channels that have participated in share the seed pack. The se share the pack, the seed pack that is. Um, and uh, maybe check out and see if they put out a video and uh, see what goodies they picked from it. And uh, travel on with the box as it heads over to Morse Patch of Heaven Homestead. So we are going to say good night. Thank you so much. <laughs> as he's picking through pepper seeds. <laughs> uh, thanks for joining us. As always, take care. And God bless. Good night, guys. <laughs>